Released in 2015, the BlackBerry Priv is now a five-year-old phone as of 2020. How well does it stack up today? The BlackBerry Priv is fairly outdated as it has a Snapdragon 808 processor known for having some overheating issues. During my time using it, it did get less hot and have better battery life after getting the Android Marshmallow update. The battery life lasts all day with around medium usage. Performance is not very good as it is kind of laggy even for quite simple tasks. It currently still runs Android Marshmallow and is very outdated in terms of software updates. Despite the drawbacks, it is still a decent option for the keyboard lover. With the slider mechanism, the BlackBerry Priv has a decent keyboard. To this day, the keyboard still holds up decently. However, I personally still prefer the BlackBerry Classic's keyboard over the Privs. It is still one unique smartphone as it has a slider mechanism as well as a physical keyboard. The charger out of the box sucks, but can be fixed with additional, with the addition of a quick charge brick like the Anchor PowerPort charger. Overall, I would only recommend the BlackBerry Priv for the BlackBerry and keyboard lover, as there are plenty of better performing and updated smartphones today. Like to try the Galaxy Note 8, I would recommend getting